Well, he's lost the ball. Damian. Well, I think we better go over to Alex Scott quickly because Alex, I'm hearing there's been a goal in the Genoa game. Yes, another goal for Fiorentina. They're ahead by two now with 61 minutes played. Many thanks as ever, Alex. Composed and patient passing. They're trying to take their time, but not enough care on the ball. Moving forward effectively. Crossing into the middle. No nonsense clearance. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Counter attacking chance. Really nice ball. And making sure nothing untoward happened following the cross. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. And space to cross it. Well read to put an end to that attack. Twenty minutes to go in this one. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick. Well, a brilliantly executed free kick. So near, Stuart. Well, he'll have practiced that time and time again. It's a fantastic bit of technique, but he just can't get it down in time. That's useful play. Churia. And that'll be offside. Deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Barella. Really good challenge. And into the last 15 minutes of action. Samuele Birindelli. Right time for a scoring update from the Genoa game. And that means we send it over to Alex Scott. It's a goal for Genoa. They're back in this now with 76 minutes played. Thanks as always, Alex. Danger averted for now. Barella. Well, no stopping him. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Now breaking at pace. Potential danger. Well, what an atmosphere we've got inside San Siro. The fans are driving their players on. Surely they can hold on here. And support available. And the cross into the middle. Well, clattered away. Just cutting off the supply. Gianluca Caprari. They know what they need, and that's an equaliser here. And let's give credit to the defending. Pavard. Well, on the closing stages, it's all about Inter's quest to see this out. Stuart, how would you critique their performance in this one? Well, it's been a tight game, but I think they've been the better team. They've just had that little bit more quality, certainly in attack. And, of course, they've been well organised at the back. They just need to see this through now. D'Ambrosio. Samuele Birindelli. It's with Akpa Akpro. What can they do to stop him running at them? Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Carlos Augusto. And that will do it. The referee brings this match to an end. Inter entitled to be...
here for the riddle. Maybe just a little. Jump in the middle, all eyes on me like I'm blown in the whistle. The chrome like a tone that like could take your throne if you wish to. Blown like a tissue, yeah, I do miss you. Yeah, we could talk, but mad that you caught up. Could it interfere with this toy that you brought up? Pause in the court, like pause in the stir, like use what you heard, but too. It burns bright, didn't determine, stop for the turn signs, signs turning. After nine, if the line's working, your worst advice, where's your mind lurking? New York, New York, I'm scared. They have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Who can they pick out? Half. Top class defending. Might really be able to trouble them here. In the middle. Must take the lead here. Oh, he's blocked it! Surely, goalkeeping of the highest order! Well, he's got to be pleased with that save. It's absolutely magnificent. Let's see about the delivery. Good clearance. Possession given away, unfortunately. Mancosu. He's got to score! Strong hand on that one. Cleared away. Both managers deciding this is the time to change things around. Both teams going to the bench. Still passing it around with authority. Really fine piece of defending play to break it up. Daniel, now the quick counter-attack could be on. And passing it through. Well, it was so easy on the eye, that counter-attack, but no reward for them. Yeah, it was all good until the final effort. It just shows how devastating they can be on the break, though. Moving it forward. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Decent position. Turam, chance to put them in front. And a goal! Just when we wondered if this might finish nil-nil. There it is. They're in front. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? Yes. 
Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. Determined defending. Martinez. Daniel. And Inter might be able to cash in here. Turam. Oh, that's splendid play. Might be a chance here. They've only gone and grabbed another one. Two goals in quick succession. Now they have the lead. No wonder they're celebrating. Lapadula. Mancosu. Rog has it. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. Now we're inside the final ten minutes in this one. Good through ball. Oh, what an opportunity. A goal! How about that? He's put it away to make it a hat-trick. Well, it's a decent goal, but the defenders certainly played their part. Where were they? They were absolutely all over the place. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Lapadula into regaining possession. The referee's letting it go as they keep the ball. Daniel, a oh, good vision there. Well, what a stop it was. Well, I have to say, that's a magnificent save. That's a top-class piece of goalkeeping. And the referee, retrospectively, will go back and hand out the yellow card. And over it comes. Still alive. Well, able to survive that attacking push. Rog. Eldor Shomurodov. Giving it a try. Stopped a certain goal. Well, what can they do to stop him running at them? But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Counter attacking, very much an option. And that'll be offside. And just one minute of time added on for stoppages. But well, he's certainly not alone. He'll have a go here. Oh, what an astonishing goal! Almost from a different postal. So the final whistle, the referee says that will be all for this game. And the big headline is Inter victorious. What did you think of their performance, Alton? Oh, he's blocked it! Leave my wallet out this argument, I'm six foot I spend all my money, I be six foot All my 
nothing crypto in the market. Took a dip, ooh. 20 count kip, look. Money now we out to this. A plus I got my loaf all around me like an oculus. Sandbox a lot of this. Certified they heard of us. Three fell off the curves and as a murder got the word of us. Never let that burden us take that trip with a curve. Of Time for a change then. Sotil, Mandragora, Lucas Martinez Cuarta, Rolando Mandragora. Well, the attack looks promising. Happy to shoot. He's blocked it. Martinez, Cuadrado. And thrusting through the gears, Juan Cuadrado. Well, it came to nothing in the end. Bonaventura. He's got space. It might be. Oh, really commanding goalkeeping. And it is substitution time at this juncture. Not just from one side, but from both. Delivered by Bonaventura. And a struggle to get it away properly. Martinez. Daniel. This looks promising. Crossing possibilities. Must take the lead here. Oh, it was a crucial challenge. Can they hit on the break? Mbala and Zola. Barak has it. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Good idea. And a goal! Just when we wondered if this might finish nil nil. There it is. They're in front. Here it is again, and it's all about pace and transition. They're so quick to get out to the back, and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one foot in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. So the ball rolling again, with the scoreline standing at 1-0. Mbala and Zola. Bonaventura with it. And they need to get tighter. A chance to whip it in. Well, fine hold-up play here. Determined defending. Clattered away. Daniel. Now well, attacking possibilities for the Nerazzurri. And let's give credit to the defending. Chance maybe to use the counter-attacking ability to good effect. Bonaventura, surely the equaliser. Oh, that's a fine save. Well, they've decided to make a change. Can he deliver it with accuracy? And the goalkeeper has outdone himself with that save. Able to clear the danger, at least for now. It is a decent looking attack here. Is it going to be? And up for grabs off the keeper. Danger averted for now. Artur. Bonaventura A good vision there and Fiorentina have it back now
Dodo. Good bit of closing down. Well, very late in the contest, and it's Inter holding a marginal lead. Stuart, interested in your thoughts on their overall performance? Well, it's been a tight game, but I think they've been the better team. They've just had that little bit more quality, certainly in attack, and of course they've been well organised at the back. They just need to see this through now. Superbly read and executed. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Martinez. Managed to get it out of there. Well, the stoppage time situation. One minute here. Martinez. It's with Chalanolu. Quadrado running with the ball confidently and what a magical save it was and they're making a change can someone get on the end of this and knocked out of there so the final whistle the referee says that will be all for this game and the big headline is Inter victorious what did you think of that? Well, this is the kind of match every football fan looks forward to. A lot on the line. All roads today lead to the San Siro here in Milan. It's the Derby della Madonnina, Milan against Inter. My name is Derek Ray, and joining me for commentary, as always on these special occasions, is Stuart Robson. Stuart, what are you looking forward to seeing in this one? Well, Derek, I have to say, this is always a game I look forward to, particularly the styles of play. Milan against Inter, this is a wonderful arena. Let's hope it's an entertaining game as well. Now, just the tackle that was needed. The Inter starting lineup. Jan Zommer is the goalkeeper. Francesco Acerbi plays alongside Benjamin Pavar in central defence. Hakan Chalanolu plays alongside Nicolo Barella in the centre of midfield. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. Composed and patient passing. Oh, great block. And here's how Milan will line up. 
Davide Calabria plays with Teo Hernandez in the wide defensive areas and it's two strikers up front who look to provide the goal scoring threat And the focus on Lautaro Martinez, who is an uncomplicated sort of footballer. I mean that in a positive way. What do you think we'll see from him in this match? Well, Derek, there are a few better players in the air. He's so dangerous when balls come into the box. So expect crossing to be a big part of their game plan today. But it was a magnificent result for Inter in their last game against Fiorentina. How do you think this one will go, Stuart? Yes, I thought it was a good 1-0 win in front of their own fans. Today, however, they may not enjoy quite as much of the ball and therefore a draw looks the most likely outcome. On the ball to Kwesi. And Inter doing well to win the ball back. Carlos Augusto. It's with Chalanolu. Daniel. He's going forward well here. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. <laughs> Rafael Leao. Went in strongly, decisively. Oh, great vision. Really important tackle. And room to roam on the wing for Milan. Olivier Giroud. Rafael Leao. Really good build-up, but no end product. Alessandro Bastoni Barella Daniel Martinez Oh, big chance! A goal! Inter take the lead in the derby! And how much does it mean to them? Just listen! Well, here it is. 1v1 against the keeper, and the outcome was never really in doubt. He never looked like missing that. And then back underway. 1-0 it is. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. Benacer Leal and now with Pulisic this could be the equaliser and he did what he had to do defensively well but also Neri being afforded too much space it needs an accurate cross Using his physical strength to make sure he doesn't lose the ball. Ben Asser. And return to Giroud. That's a promising Milan move. But nothing comes of it. Daniel. The ball with Martinez. Trying to open up the defence and missing the chance to give them a bit of breathing space. Well, that should have made it more comfortable, shouldn't it? But it's a wasted opportunity. Well, the first 45 minutes have come and gone here at the San Siro. And the... Well, the referee blowing his whistle to indicate that the second half is underway. It's Inter with the lead, but still there is work to do.
really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. Ben Asa. A lot to look forward to on the Champions League group stage front here on EA TV. Live, it's Inter against Real Sociedad. I like the look of that game. The atmosphere is always good inside that stadium and two very good teams. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Chalanolu. Effective challenge. Ficayo Tomori. And he read it well. Can he finish this? Well, it really looked as though that was going to be another goal from him. Well, a chance for his second there. Probably should have done a bit better there, really. Danger still on. Oh, good strike. Oh, from miles out, he's done it. How about that for a pure strike? Terrific technique. One press. Well, here it is again, and wow, just take a look at this. He's absolutely mad with this one. What a strike that is from distance. Well, he looks really pleased, doesn't he? His side have been really good today. So back underway with the lead standing at 2 0. Chukwese. Just a quick reminder, we've got Champions League group stage action for you to look forward to here on EA TV. It's Milan taking on Newcastle United. Well, the fixtures are coming thick and fast. It should be a good game, that. Hopefully, I've not just given it the commentator's curse. Alessandro Bastoni. Barella has it. On the ball, Bastoni. Daniel Barella has it at times they make passing look easy but it was a good looking sequence but it comes to an end Olivier Giroud the Rossoneri pushing forward with options available how about the cross? Olivier Giroud at the ready. And clears the danger. Now can they counter clinically? Clean challenge. Did really well to get through. And a long way out here. Oh, good work by the keeper. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. And there's the delivery, and making sure it wasn't problematic. Augusto. Benacer. Must be! Keeper did his job to begin with. And second time around, he scores! But the keeper left to wonder what his defenders were doing. Well, back underway, Milan still behind, but they've made this a contest. Benassa. The clock is against Milan, but they've got the ability still to hit back. This could level it. Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And there it is! The Rossoneri level the contest! Chalanolu. Lucien Agoumé. 
Level pegging here. Inter on the attack. Well, disappointing end to the move. Giroud. Olivier Giroud. Nicely timed tackle. Well, you can hear the Inter fans just driving their team forward. Are we going to have a dramatic finish here? And he cuts inside. Not out of the woods yet. And eventually, goalkeeper's ball. Well, you can. And that's going to be it for this game as the referee brings the match to an end. Well, it was a keenly. Und sie steht voll auf Mama Und ist nie lange so hoch Ihr Beuteschema sind andere Männer, die an uns Frauen gehören Sie kennt keine Fehler, flattert mit jedem, sie ist eine Spielerin So unscheinbar, doch sie spielt dir fast vollkommen nicht zu nah Du machst mich noch zu einem This is the night both sets of supporters have been waiting for. Not long now until kickoff on match day one in the Champions League. Who will get off to a positive start with all three points? It's Real Sociedad. Hello and welcome to the Anueta here in San Sebastian. And I'll tell you what, I hope that we're devouring plenty of exciting football. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for expert analysis by my partner Stuart Robson. And what we have for you tonight is live Champions League group stage match day one action. It's Real Sociedad up against Inter. Well, the first game of the group is so vital. You just can't get off to a losing start. This could be a tight battle today, Derek. And the starting 11 for Real Sociedad. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. Inter's lineup is as follows. Jan Zommer is the goalkeeper. Benjamin Pavard plays with Francesco Acerbi in central defence. Hakan Chalhanolu starts alongside Nicolo Barella in the centre of midfield. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. And a good take under duress there. That's day one in the Champions League. Always exciting. And as soon as the teams were drawn into this particular group, we all thought, my goodness, that's a hard one to predict the outcome of. Yeah, this is a tough group, that's for sure. It's anybody's guess who will go through. So it's absolutely vital that the teams get off to a good start here. This should be a great game, Derek. The crowd encouraging him to take it on. An alert piece of defending. Going well. And calling upon all his defensive qualities. Mikel Marino. He 
it's with Mikel Marino. In possession, Mendes here. Andre Silva. And he read it well defensively. Well, you can probably see why we're focusing on this fellow as one to watch. Stewart, in particular, what do you expect to see from him? Well, Derek, he comes into this game full of confidence because in the last match, he was outstanding. He got his two goals, but his general play made him the best player on the pitch by a long way. And the keeper was always likely to do his job under no pressure. Oyar Sabal. Mikel Marino. Oh, he's given the ball away. Barella. Agumi. It's with Chalanolu. Federico Di Marco. Martinez. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. He read it well. Mikel Marino. In possession, Mendes here. Oh, he's left his marker for dead. Could be. Oh, great goalkeeping. Well, that's a top quality save. Great anticipation. And there's the delivery. And the problem not completely solved. Chance here. And the keeper getting a crop. That's a foul. And it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. Well, not the ideal free kick. And straight into the wall. Cleared away. Subeldia. Subi Mendy. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Can they trouble the opposition this time? A disappointing end to the move. Chananolu. The ball with Martinez. Lucia Agumé. Barella. Oh, in with a chance. Off the post and back in play. Kubo. Andre Silva with it. Oyar Sabal. Tierney. Now will the cross work out for them? Well, an opportunity here for them to get their noses in front from the corner. Can he deliver it with accuracy? And a goal! 1 0 it is. They've been pushing for the opener, and now they have it. And there is going to be stoppage time, but only the one minute. And the referee's whistle indicates... So underway once again. And not enough wet to plan for Inter in that first half. Can they address that in the second 45? Be Mendy in possession, Mendes here. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. A game that will certainly hold the interest of many in Serie A live coming up on EA TV. It's Inter facing Empoli. Inter have given away possession.
Now can they make something happen? A fine reading of the situation. Andre Silva. Bryce Mendes. Marino. Nicely timed tackle. Breaking at pace. Barella. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Andre Silva. In possession, Mendes here. Andre Silva with it. Well, Winter a bit wasteful in possession. Plenty of options. And let's give credit to the defending. Pavard. Agumi. Varela has it. Martinez. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Surely! A goal! Real excitement! A back-and-forth type of game. Now they're level. Well, I have to say, this is a really good goal. Just look how well balanced he is. He knows he's going to be under pressure, but he shows great composure to hit the target. So back underway following the equaliser. Martinez. Chalanolu. What can he do with it now? Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Aware of the threat, solving the problem. Very quick thinking there. Andre Silva. And the attack looks promising, but nothing comes of it. Bryce Mendes. Nice looking move, this. It has to be. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. And Inter doing well to regain possession. Mickey Tarian. And still they are locked together. Inter remain on the attack near the end. Just ten minutes remaining here. Can they hit on the break? Andre Silva. Not getting anxious when they have the ball. They just couldn't play that decisive ball. Well, not long left now, but this crowd have been brilliant. Can the players get a winner here? And teammates around him, but timely defending when it mattered. Well, it could be on for him here. And a goal! This is why we adore this game. Late drama, and now they're in front. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace in transition. They're so quick to get out from the back, and there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Well, 2-1 it is here. Takafusa Kubo. It's with Mikel Marino. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. 
You can't really tackle like that and expect to get away with it. Booking to come, you would think. Well, full time it is here and a well-earned victory for Inter to get their campaign going. Well, you always want to get off to a good start and that's exactly... Well, just the sort of weather the fans were hoping for this evening. It's absolutely ideal. I'm Derek Ray, and adjacent to me in the commentary box is Stuart Robson. I'm directly looking forward to bringing you live coverage of this match being played in Serie A. It's Empoli up against Inter. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key. Can he make it 1-0? And confidently convert it! And with that, they thwarted the opportunity. Martinez. Alberto Grassi on the ball Pezzella Razvan Marin well, still searching for the equaliser but not passing it anxiously and the keeper able to hold on to it Agume Daniel Good looking sequence. Oh, it did so well to deny him. Uh, 
Can they extend their lead? And he slots it home with confidence. Can they convert? Well, plenty of power there, but in fair... Nicely timed tackle. Well, space for Inter in the wide position. Beautiful pass. Well, they couldn't take advantage of the opportunity. And options in the centre. Speculative ball fired to the near post. Very much run of the mill as saves. Given away by Inter. And there goes the final whistle. The Inter fans full of the joys because it's three points for them. What did you make of it all? Well, fairly comfortable in the end, wasn't it? Thought they controlled... Born in the same county as them, but me with a hunger and a flow so cold. Nothing like dreams could have been saying the old, but ever since that day, it's up and bold. Out and pack, step in the room, all eyes on us, now we can't look back. Gally on us and that's two times two, so for sure. You know they rock red than that, it's mad. Step back, get back, see be tension. You don't want to feel this rap like pocket. You don't want to start no clash. You don't want me to come and just, just die. And then we'll get frightened. Only for my side, now only for the light. Smiting, yeah, smiting. They know I'ma go out of the floors like Poseidon. Uh, they think it's easy, come my friend, it's coming easy, breezy, breezy. Look at dirt and all the we just grind. Uh, I feel like busy when I'm here, not a chat, a chat up his stomach, talk we can pose and slide. I'm only here for one night, trying to have a good time. A chat, chat, over chill, chill, just slow. They never knew, but now they're not, so now we chuckle. Being with Cruddy, being with a force, all my brothers have individual thoughts. Really get a busy, they wanna see me turn nauseous. Heartbreaker, please step with caution. Whoa, you see, huh, we were the same until Swarby came to a step at the game. I set levels, calling me your main boss, or all the ring your main. I really got a mission, jealousy up in the veins. God knows what I want in my life, so I just pat on the side. Look at my eyes, I got a miss a prize. We really got the prize, no surprise that they, uh, they think it's easy, come my bread is them. A big night at one of the most famous venues in world football. We're here at the San Siro. I'm Derek Ray, in position to bring you live match commentary. And my expert analyst, as always on these occasions, is Stuart Robson. And we're focusing on live action from Italy's top division. That's not a bad ball. Not messing around with that clearance. Martinez being egged on by the crowd. Well, somehow the goalkeeper got to it. Now he must favour the cross. Martinez! And not cleared away properly.
And he says it with authority. Christian Torstved. Opportunity in the wide area. Cross fired over. Fed forwards. Will he find the net? And he's missed the opportunity. And that will be all for this game anyway. No goals to report. Defences on top. And Stuart, as ever, interested to get your take. Will do it. An action. Just got a parking fine, but I'm drifted in irons. Who cares? Just sold a few tickets, racked up a few digits. name is Derek Ray this is how it looks for the home side well it's a 3-4-2-1 so it's going to be interesting to see what's expected of the wing backs here are they going to be high up the field or drop deeper oh wait Stuart they might score a truly magnificent start an early goal in the game just what they were And he has players waiting at the back post. Just the clearance that was called for. Yeah. 
And now to level the game. And confidently converted. And quite simply, wide of the target. Feeding it through. Now he's got to stay calm. Surely. And a goal! That's his brace. They just can't keep him quiet. Good idea. Oh, great defending. Chance to equalise here. And slot it home! Well, his heart might have been fluttering, but he didn't. Cabral Can they forge ahead Magnificent challenge to win it back Well nothing for them to worry about in the end Good defence Defensive Brazilians to shut them down. So the final whistle and no win. I'm not sure what I would have done if you had a diet. My other half. I promise to say I love you more and to only make wild and precious memories with you. I'll be here with you until the end. I'll never forget how close I came to losing my tummy. And hello from one of the great venues in world football, the San Siro in the city of Milan. I'm Derek Ray, and joining me to provide expert analysis is... And defensive play to be applauded. Over it comes. It hasn't come to very much. A oh, good vision there. He cuts it back. Right go ahead. Brilliant save. And just blotting out the danger. And we've entered the final five minutes. And passing it through. And he might be in here. Oh, a goal! And is that going to be the one that wins it for them? There's every chance. And the fans are lapping this up.
Hello, everyone. Well, our venue today is a true football monument. I'm talking, of course, about the San Siro. I'm Derek Ray. And this is how it looks for Inter. Jan Zoma is the goalkeeper. Hakan Chalhanolu starts alongside Nicolo Barella in the centre of midfield. And the story in attack is one of us. Good through ball. And there the move will end because it's off. That's a good looking shot. And taking care of the situation. And now having a go. Oh, that's a really good pass. Nicely timed tackle. timing for you what a challenge well maybe a good position from which to counter and he's made headway oh stellar defensive work to get back and win Barella a decent delivery did well to win the ball back feeding it through now the task is to remain focused Oh, keeper dealt with it. And that is that. The full-time whistle here. And... I'm not sure what I would have done if you had a diet. My other half. I promise to say I love you more and to only make wild and precious memories with you. I'll be here with you until the end. I'll never forget how close I came. Losing my tummy. This one's for you. And a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray in position to bring you live match commentary. And my expert analyst, as always on these occasions, is Stuart Robson. I'm greatly looking forward to bringing you live.
He'll have a go here. And he's through here. Well, it might still work out for them. Top class defending. And Inter with acres of space out wide. And whipped into the box. Well, thumped clear. Well, they have the advantage. That's good. It's there for him. Oh, he's blocked it. Well, a corner and maybe an opportunity. Well, this could... Can they convert? And he's got and scored to level as a... Opportunity! And a goal! Just like that! They're... Beautifully weighted ball. And it's opening up. Magnificent stuff. And quite the comeback from two goals down. Il signor Matteo Zanotti è pregato di recarsi immediatamente al posto di polizia dello stadio dove lo attendono le figlie Emma e Greta. Oh, that's not useful. Can he put it away? And there goes the final whistle. The Inter fans full of the joys because it's three points for them. What did you make of it all? Well, Derek, it was a really tight game, but they were the better... And hello from one of the great venues in world football, the San Siro in the city of Milan. 
My name is Derek Ray, and sitting alongside me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and West Ham midfield player Stuart Robson. And very excited to be bringing you this group stage game from the UEFA Champions League. It's Inter facing Zalt. And over comes the corner. Was it a great clearance? Chalanolu. Great opportunity. Well, he opted for power from close range. Can he give them the advantage? And a goal it is! No long wait for the opener today. in the centre and the danger cleared Chalanolu Varela Drawing his luck. And there's the delivery. Clearance needed to be better. Fernando. It's there for him. to go the fans want to see a shot so the final whistle the referee says that will be all for this game and the big headline is Inter victorious what did you think of their performance Alter? Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. We'll have every kick of the ball for you. Well, it is a stadium that absolutely oozes history. Here we are at the San Siro in Milan. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, at the microphone. And sitting alongside me is the former Arsenal, West Ham and Coventry midfield player, Stuart Robson. And the focus is very much on Serie A, the top division here in Italy. Stuart, what are you expecting? Well, thanks, Derek. The best coach I played under would always tell us before kickoff 
earn the right to play. If you can win your individual battles, outrun your opponent, eventually you'll get the space to show your ability. I'm sure that's being echoed by the coaches here today. Inter's lineup is as follows. Jan Zoma is the goalkeeper. Francesco Acerbi plays alongside Benjamin Pavar in central defence. Hakan Chalhanolu starts alongside Nicolo Barella in the centre of midfield. And it's two strikers up front who look to provide the goal scoring threat. This is how the visitors will set up today. Rui Patricio is the keeper. Lorenzo Peregrini plays alongside Brian Cristante in central midfield. And up front, Paolo Di Bala starts alongside Romelu Lukaku. And keeping hold of the ball. And a textbook interception. Agume. Well, as we glance at the table, it really is shaping up to be a captivating season, highly competitive, especially at the summit. Well, what a great title race this looks like, Ben. Yes, there's a long way to go, but it's difficult to split these teams at the moment. Let's hope I'm right. Dybala. Lorenzo Pellegrini with it. Strong but fair tackle. Martinez. Inter in a position of menace. But the danger averted for now. Brian Tristante. He read the situation defensively and did his job. But ahead of this game, one man certainly in the news, Romelu Lukaku, playing against his old club, and I wonder what's going through his mind, Stuart. Well, he shouldn't approach this differently to any other game. He's just got to forget the crowd and go out and play. Pellegrini. And strong play here. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. They'll try to take their time, but not enough care on the ball. Chalanolu. The ball with Martinez. Daniel. Can he do it? Chance maybe. It was an attack of promise, but they couldn't take advantage of the situation. Rui Patricio. And back to the keeper. Well, you never quite know who's going to emerge from the shadows and become a match winner, but this man might be a decent shot. What a chance this is, Derek. Oh, did so well to deny him. He's driven in the corner. And still dangerous. Failure to keep the ball by Inter. Well, sitting deep and just trying to form a really coherent block. And the cross goes in. And well positioned to clear. Very alert defending to cut off the supply. Pellegrini. Lukaku now. Pellegrini. Dybala. Romelu Lukaku now. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Martinez. And he has options available. But nothing comes of it. Brian Tristante. Well, that's going to be all for the first half here at the San Siro.
Well, they've got things going again here, and I wonder what kind of second half we have in store for us. And a timely intervention. A really good pass. Oh, disappointing clearance. Daniel. It is a decent looking attack here, but quick thinking defensively. Ndika. It's with Celic. Mancini. And now Ndika. Rui Patricio. Mancini. Mehmet Zeki Celic. Really closing him down. Daniel. Just cutting off the supply. Renato Sanchez. Well, just a quick reminder, more live football coming your way here on EA TV. I think you might enjoy this game. And what a game that will be. Two good teams in a great stadium. I'm really looking forward to that one. And they'll get ready for the throw-in. Doing well to keep possession. Well, sadly, they just couldn't keep possession. Lucien Agoumé. Martinez. Well, attacking possibilities for the Nerazzurri, but they dealt with the threat posed. Ndika. Brian Tristante. Here's Renato Sanchez. Well, no shortage of live action coming your way right here on EA TV. And Stuart and I looking forward to being with you for this match. That looks a really entertaining game. Two good teams with two excellent coaches. I can't wait for that one to come round. An alert piece of defending. Pellegrini. It's with Dybala. Renato Sanchez. And moving the ball forward with genuine purpose here. Nicely timed tackle. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Daniel. Agumi. Barella. It's a perfect challenge. Well, they have the advantage. That's good refereeing. Brian Tristante. Romelu Lukaku now. Pellegrini. Well, here they are on the attack. Can they? Well, sometimes you need inspiration from your goalkeeper. Well, he's pulled off a decent save here. But more importantly, they stay on level terms. Just the challenge that was required. Dumfries. Fratesi. Not the pass he had in mind. Pinazzola Brian Tristante here's Renato Sanchez 
And they're on the front foot, looking for a winner near the end of this game. One minute of stoppage time has been added on. Can they forge ahead? Yes is the answer. And that could be oh so important. So the final whistle has sounded and a boost for the Nerazzurri. Three points for Inter. Your verdict. Yes, Derek. Sometimes it takes a while to eventually get the better of the opposition. And that was the case here. They kept going and they eventually got their reward.